श्री गणेशाय नम ओं श्री सरस्वत नम ओं श्री गुरुभ्यो नम ओं समस्तजनकल्याण निरत करुणा नमा चिन्म देव सद्गु ब्रह्म विधर ओं कर्पूरगौर करुणावतार संसार सारम भुजगेन्द्रहार सदा वसत हृदयारविंदे भव भवानी सहित नमा हरि ओ भगवान का और पूज्य गुरुदेव का स्मरण करके पहले हम नाम स्मरण करेंगे ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय शिवाय ओम नम 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 शिवाय नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम ओम नमः शिवाय 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 नमः शिवाय नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय ओम नमः शिवाय उमापति महादेव की जय श्री सदगुरुनाथ महाराज की जय आई एम आई एम दैट टुडे इज माय बर्थडे Uh-huh. and i am very glad that someone else also is sharing my birthday <laughs> and that is our swami advayananda <laughs> janmadin abhinandanam <laughs> and as you know the next vedant course which will start from 15th of january he will be the course acharya mm-hmm. so hearty welcome mm-hmm. now this birthday is a day of uh, contemplation of course celebrations and those who love they shower their love and i am extremely thankful 
to all those who are present here, those who are sending messages, emails and what not, for their love on this particular day. Now, remembering, as I say, God, Puja Gurudev, parents, and all of you will start our vichara. Somebody may say, even on the day of celebration, you are thinking only. Uh, but I think thinking is the best thing. What are you going to think? So far, I kept it secret. But now I have to say. Few, few years back, I was thinking on what is Amrutam. Amrutam word is used so very often. Amrita, nectar, ambrosia. Amritatva means immortality. And that word comes very often in our Shastra. So, the thought started. What is this Amrita? So, I gave the title Amrita Vicharaha. Amrita vichara, one meaning is Amrita vishaya vichara. It is an inquiry into what is this nectar? What is immortality? And the Amrita also is a visheshana of the word vichara itself. It is Amrita vichara. It is nectarian inquiry. And we know Amrita is very sweet. We have heard. One great saint had said, hmm, Amrita, Amrita, we are all talking about. Huh? But we have not tested it. But still we talk about it. Pia vina amaran hoi. Without drinking, nobody becomes immortal. So that's what we are going to do. So in the first part, now this morning session, what prompted this inquiry, there are various statements that we'll see. In the afternoon session, then we'll see what real amrita is. So, Amrita Vishaya Vicharaha, Amrita Vicharaha. Begin with prostrations to Bhagwan. And who is that Bhagwan? Amrito Madhura Shanto Deva Sarvaguna Layaha Varado Yascha Bhaktanam Tam Vande Shri Harim Sada. I bow down to Shri Hari Bhagwan and I bow down to him do Namaskar Sada always. And who is this Bhagwan? Amrutaha. He himself is Bhagwan is Amrita Swarupaha. Amrita Swarupaha. And a beautiful statement this, uh, that is there in our Upanishad. Shrunvantu sarve amrutascha putraha. Bhagwan is Amrita and we are his children, therefore we are called Amrita putraha. We are children of that immortal Bhagwan. So therefore we are also immortal only. But how and all that, that we have to see. Amrutaha. And Amruta naturally will be Madhuraha. Madhura, very sweet. 
स्वीटनेस इट सेल्फ देव भगवान इज द वेरी सोर्स ऑफ ऑल स्वीटनेस इन लाइफ वॉट एवर बी कंसिडर्ड एज स्वीट बट भगवान इज द वेरी सोर्स ऑफ दैट अमृत मधुर शांत भगवान शांत स्वरूप पीसफुल पीस इट सर देव देव गॉड देव मी चैतन्य स्वरूप प्योर कॉन्शियसनेस सर्व गुणालय इज अ वेरी अबोर्ड ऑफ ऑल वर्च्यूज सकल कल्याण गुण निधान इज दैट भगवान अबोर्ड ऑफ ऑल वर्च्यूज दैट इज ऑल रेट बट वी मे से ऑल रेट भगवान इज अमृत मधुर शांत सर्व गुणाल बट वॉट डू वी गेट फ्रॉम हिम इज इज वरदश्च वरदो यश्च भक्ता and those who are devoted to him varada varam dadati graciously blessing granting all boons what you want now that depend upon you then because bhagwan can give bhukti mukti bhakti everything varada yascha bhaktana तम वंदे श्री हरि सदा श्री हरि भगवान श्री हरि हरको मेरी मे लक्ष्मीपति ऑल्सो हाँ श्री इज ब्रह्म विद्या स्वरूप हरि रिमूवर ऑफ ऑल अवर अज्ञानादि दुखम सौर एवरीथिंग दैट भगवान वी बॉन्ट अमृत मधुर शांत देव सर्वगुणाल वरद यक्ता वंदे तम वंदे श्रीहरि सदा नौ द क्वेश्चन अमृत नाम किं पेय वाछंति स्म सुरा सुरा यभा क्षीराब्धेमंथन बला अमृत नाम किं पेय वाट इज दि ड्रिंक पेय काल अमृत वी नो मेरी मेरी ड्रिंक्स आर दैट आर अवेलेबल हियर और व्हाट इज दिस अमृत टॉक्ट अबाउट वाछंति स्म सुरासुरा इन पौराणिक स्टोरी वी नो आल दि देवताज एंड असुराज वाछंति स्म देव डिजायर्ड देव वॉन्टेड अमृत यभार्थी कृत तैयार क्षीराब्धेमंथन एंड टू गेन दैट दिस देवता एंड असुरा बो टुगेदर did the very churning of the milky ocean that's a most fascinating story in the puranas but i am not going to go into details about all those there was a joint venture generally devta asura they are opposed to each other <coughs> but bhagwan shri hari is always very uh, playful also and, and compassionate so he said all the time don't go on fighting come together so one project was given to them both that amruta will come out and it will benefit all of you so they came together this is a very interesting story it is there in shrimad bhagavatam so they came and they did all the churning of the milky ocean so many thing happened in that time the nectar came 
and the when the nectar came dhanvantari bhagwan brought it the asuras true to their nature they seized that kalasha and went away anyway the story goes on bhagwan you know always savior of devtas but now the question is what is this amrut for which all gods and demons both of them came together huh and they did the churning of the milky ocean so this is according to the puranic story it gives us a thought what is that amrutam hmm? then वेदे प्रार्थित दृष्ट मृत्योर्मा अमृत गमय मृत्योर्मुक्षीय अमृता मंत्रे तथा च सो दि स्टोरी क्षीराब्दी मंथन इज इन द पुराण बट वेदे इन द वेद आलसो वाट वी फैंड देर इज ए प्रेयर प्रार्थित दृष्ट इट इज सीन दैट प्रार्थना इज एन वाट you know famous mantra that all of you know asatoma sadgamaya tamasoma jyotirgamaya mrityorma amrutam gamaya o oh lord lead us from unreal to real from darkness to light and from death to immortality there also it is said then there is a very famous mantra if i start you can also chant om trambakam yajamahe sugandhim pushti vardhanam urvarukami bhavandanan mrityor mukshi amam vrtaat so there also that famous mahamrityunjay mantra there also said मृत्यो मुक्षीय भगवान प्लीज रिलीज अस फ्रॉम डेथ मा अमृता बट नॉट फ्रॉम इमोटैलिटी अमृता में वैंट सो इन द वेद वी सी सच प्रेयर पुराण ऑल्सो वी सी दैट कथा and another very famous shruti you know when uh, sanyasi and all that and they come you know uh, they are received with purna kumbha and what are the famous mantra that also i think you know om nakarmana na prajaya dhane tyage naike amrutatva manashu tyage na eke अमृतत्व मानसु सो दिस अमृतत्व इमोटैलिटी इज नॉट गेन बाय कर्म प्रजा प्रोजिनी धने न बाय दैट यू डोंट गेट त्यागेन ओनली बाय त्याग रिनंसिएशन संन्यास अलोन यू गेन दैट there is very famous um, episode in in the brudaranya upanishad yadnivalki rishi had two wives maitreyi and katyayani yadnivalki rishi was a very huge guru kul ha he was very rich but then he thought of taking sanyas in a fish so he called both of them both these wives and all the wealth he shared and i am going so kateni did not say anything nothing is mentioned more about that but she was also a great great patni but maitri asked very very pertinent question maitri asked giving all this wealth to me and then you are taking sanyas will i become immortal by this wealth 
what a wonderful question uh, and yadnevar krishi great husband and he very clearly said amrutatasya na aasha asti vittena you can't get immortality by this any amount of wealth the wealth can make your life comfortable in this worldly plane nothing more than that not immortal why oh, sir then comes the most important statement from maitri yena aham amruta nasyam that if i i don't become immortal free from the fear of all these death and all that what will i do with this wealth i don't want that that's a most powerful statement and then yadnevel krishi was so pleased and he enlightened her now i i don't have to go to that story but what he said here न कर्मण न प्रजया न धन त्याग न एक अमृतत्व आयुष वाट इज दैट इमोटालिटी विच इज गेट बाय दिस त्याग सो दैट वर्ड कम्स एवरी टाइम नो अमृत अमृतत्व एंड ऑल दैट अनादर श्रुति केनोपनिषद से आत्मना विंदते वीर विद्यया विंदते अमृत हाँ आत्मना विंदते वीर ऑल स्ट्रेंथ कम्स फ्रॉम योर ओन सेल्फ एंड अमृतत्व इमोटालिटी इज गेन्ड बाय विद्या बाय नॉलेज समटाइम इट इज ए Vidya vindate viryam and atmana vindate amrutam. <laughs> Immortality comes from your own self, and strength comes from vidya, knowledge. Uh, uh, both way it is right, you know. Vidya gives amrutatto. Now I must tell you some some stories also here and there also, you know. there was a king i don't know his name and his kingdom and all that but somehow he was not a very scholarly person and honoring great poets thinkers and all that so one person was there he 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 was a poet also but became so beggar he wanted to have an audience with the king but do you think that he will give that audience so what happened he committed a theft and in those days administration and judiciary were one in the same so only the king only used to listen and give the verdict so why do you know why he committed theft that he thought he will be brought before the king he was brought and king you know in those kings also were very sometimes whimsical also uh, he committed some theft say hang him to death babare what kind of punishment now that poor kavi i came for some little thing i'll get and now i'm getting this capital punishment but you know as the rule is a before a person is hanged he is asked what is your last wish so the king said what is your last wish anyway tell 
So he said, I want to recite one shloka. The king said, Bhavare. I have to listen to a shloka. Actually, it is a shoka only for me. Anyway, now for last, you know, tell Sunade. So he recited a shloka. Bhattir nashto bharavi yopi nashtaha bhikshur nashtaha bhimasen yopi nashtaha bhukkundoham bhupatistvam charajan bhavbhavalyam antakaha sannivishtaha And when the Raja heard that, he said, please release him. Now you may ask, what happened in that shloka? That Kavi, his name was Bhukkunda. Bhukkunda. He said, Maharaj, you know Sanskrit alphabets. Huh? Uh, kaka ki ki kuku. Huh? In the same way, bha bha bhi bhi bhu bhu bhe bhai bho bho bhom bha. Maharaj, that Yamraj has entered the row of Bhabha Bibi. <laughs> huh? One is, there was one Kavi Bhatti, Bhatti, Bhatti Nashtaha. He died. Then Bha, Bharvi, he also died. Bhatti Nashtaha, Bharvi, Yopesha, Bhikshur Nashtaha, Bhi, Raswavi. Bhima Senopi Nashtaha and Bhima Sen also Nashtaha. Bhabha Bhi Bhi Bhukkundoham and I am Bhukkunda, I am standing in the line, huh? but remember Bhupati Stomcharajan, <laughs> next is your number. Because Bhupati you are, no? Bhabha Valyam in the row of Bhabha Bhi Bhi Antakaha Sannivishtaha. So that Yamraj is seeing whose name is Bha, Bha, Bhi, Bhi, Bhu. So if you save me, your number will be saved. <laughs> so Raja said, release him. <laughs> this is called Vidyaya Amritam. <laughs> Immortality is gained by knowledge. Good story? Uh, some of you have heard, some of you might not have heard. Huh? Atmana vindate viryam vidyaya vindate amrutam. See, by doing this amrutu vichar, you find out where, where this amrutu word has come. Isho panishadi vakyam vidya karma samuchaye avidyaya amrutyum tirtva. Vidyaya Amrutam Ashnute. And when you read Isha Vasya Upanishad, so in Isha Vasya also, the mantra, the combination of Vidya and Avidya that is pointed out there. So Isha Upanishad Vakyam, Vidya Karma Samuchaye, the combination of Vidya and Karma. And there the statement is Avidyaya Amrutyum Tirtva, Vidyaya Amrutam Ashnute. They say by avidya you cross over death and by vidya you gain immortality. See why all these quotations are given. So then you start thinking what is this Amrita Amrita we are talking about. In the Purana said, in the Veda, Upanishad, everywhere it is said, Acha. Shruti ne bola, Puran ne bola, what about Shruti? He said, evam hi prah gītāyāṁ pārthāya bhagavān svayam. In the Bhagavad Gītā also Bhagavān has said, Bhagavān svayam, Bhagavān has said to Arjuna, pārtha. What did he say? He said, Nyeyam yat tat pravakshami yadnyatva amrutam ashnute. Bhagavan said, Arjuna, I will tell you, 
what is that which is got to be known nyayam yat tat pravakshami the shloka is there in the 13th chapter <coughs> of the bhagavad gita i shall tell you that what is that nyaya amrita gnatva yat gnatva knowing realizing which person attains immortality amrutatva vasnute तो वो श्रुति है स्मृति पुराण वेरी इट इज सेड सो वेन यू लिसन टू ऑल दिस ए थॉट अराइज एस हाँ थॉट अराइज एस वॉट अराइज एस थॉट ए तय वाक्य जिज्ञासा जायते हृदय किल को अर्थ अमृत शब्द से प्रापणीय मुमुक्षु वेन यू रीड हियर लिसन टू दी स्टेटमेंट्स एंड आई हैव जस्ट टोल्ड ओनली दी स्टोरी वॉट यू कॉल इन द पुराण अश्रुति वाक्य एंड ऑल दैट But you know, all the sadhu santas also said, "Nam Dev Maharaj said, 'Amruta huni god, nam tu se deva.' Bhagwan, your name is sweeter than Amruta. Amruta nika kahe sab koi piye bina, amaran ho koi. Everybody says, 'Amruta, Amruta is very good.' But what is that?" so not only shruti smriti puran but here also we hear all the sadhu sant sant mahatma bhakta they also speak about that amrutam to so, ko arthah ko arthash amrut shabdasya so what is the meaning of the word uh, meaning literal meaning you can see you know amruta they say nectar and ambrosia deathlessness no death and all these words you can see am amrita prapaniyo mumukshu bhi and when he said tyage nahi ke amrutatva manushu ho so those who are the seekers of this liberation mumukshu they want to know what is this we want to gain that prapaniyo mumukshu bhi तो दी जिज्ञासा जायते हृदय जिज्ञासा में दी डिजायर टू नो दी ट्रू मीनिंग ऑफ दैट अमृत राइज एस इन यूर हार्ट एंड जिज्ञासा वर्ड इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट जिज्ञासा डजन मीन ओनली ओ आई वॉन्ट टू नो आई वॉन्ट टू नो नॉट ओनली लिटरल मीनिंग वॉट इज इम्प्लाइड मीनिंग what is experience meaning the very essence of all that i want to know not only to open a dictionary and now people don't open dictionary also google only that one word guru 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 and then they want to say and for them that is the pramana param praman <laughs> that is the final proof so that we don't want to know what is this amrita we want to know very essence of that now we come back to the story of devata danvas why did they do this manthanam prapyam amrita panena balam marana muktata तदर्थ हि कृत यो मिलवा देवदान वै सी आल दि असुर दे वॉन्ट यू टू गेन ऑल पावर डिफीट देवता एंड रूल ओवर दैम एंड ऑल्सो बिकम इमॉर्टल बुद्धि देवता ऑल्सो वॉन्ट यू दी सेम थिंग 
devatas also wanted one thing called balam balam strength prowess might to defeat the asuras these deva and dano they are most wonderful also you know in one place why the devatas are there there what are their job description so the devatas are presiding over the laws of nature forces of nature so their job is to maintain the order order in this world all right devatas are meant for that why the anavas are there asuras are there so they are there to keep devatas on track ha <laughs> so <laughs> 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 somebody that when a democratic setup you know there have to be opposition also no so there is one ruling ruling party and opposition also no dictatorial system is different ha huh? but democratic setup on this way the healthy opposition should be there but generally opposition means they have to oppose anything whatever the ruling says because we are a opposition party ha huh? and you know as in here this world also that which is a ruling party now comes into minority goes opposition and the opponent they, they come into power they go on changing or not that's what used to happen in the heaven also sometimes devtas winning sometimes <laughs> asuras winning and when the asuras used to win the devtas go in hiding and they again seek bhagwan help and then again come back to power then the asuras were going somewhere the same thing is going on this world also there is no permanent ruler here anyway that is a very interesting point so devatas wanted all might to rule dhanavas also wanted all might rule and all of them are never to die ha huh? like you know some dictators and they declare them as a lifetime president <laughs> how long their life will be we don't know but they want to be there all the time so it say amruta pane no by getting that amruta and drinking prapya which was to be gained through manthanam balam marana muktata these two were their aims to gain that strength power might and also marana muktata never to die that's why you'll find out ravana also wanted i should not die all the hirinda i should not die that was their wish तदर्थम ही कृतो यत्नो मिलित्वा देवदानवै एंड फॉर दैट ओनली दिस गॉड्स एंड डीमन्स केम टुगेदर एंड डिड अमृत मंथन नाउ द क्वेश्चन इज दे डिड इट धन्वंतरी भगवान केम विद अमृत कलश आल्सो बट व्हाट हैपेंड then the fight begins you know so many parties come together but when they win the election then now no power of who will be the main person all these stories which are already there in puranas what is happening nothing new all the history is repeating <laughs> with adi daivik play <laughs> or even 
our adi bhautik this empirical plane the same thing is happening now our question is the aims and objective of that manthanam is known they did it but did they succeed ha huh? labdhwapi amrutam devaha safala na prayojane ha huh? when that nectar came the first asuras took away they were very powerful and immediately they snatched that amruta kalash from dhanvantari's hand and they ran oh devta tukur tukur dekhte rahe and the devta was looking at what happened karma guzar gaya gubar dekhte rahe they went we are only that what do you think the asuras among them also fight started ki who will drink that fashion so raja bali and all that they say ki i am thinking but they were interesting thing say there were some weak asuras also were there they started this is very unfair you know after all devata we together we have done so it is unfair that we only take we should give them as a they are too bad <laughs> no talk about on that you see <laughs> so then ama uh, asura doli five started and devata to little cry are bhagwan what kind of project you gave us you gave us great hope bhagwan said wait wait oh you got little faith i got many tricks up my sleeve i don't know he used to wear or ha huh, used to wear i think uh, i got some tricks and i know their weakness and all that so bhagwan appeared as usual most beautiful young lady tamak chamak ko chokor and all asura they started looking at me this story is very fascinating why who are you we all are fighting among ourselves you be the judge and you be the distributor but bhagwan as a mohini hota bhagwan say yeah i am just a, this kind of woman roaming about and you trust me oh yes 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 we trust you. bhagwan in a mohini roop say if you trust me you will have to do what i say Yeah, 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 yeah. First of all, go and have a bath, <laughs> and, and do some puja, whatever. Then, then sit down and do one, and I will give. They agreed. We cannot say Bhagwan cheated, because as Mohini, what telling? Are you trusting me? Uh, no, if you trust, then what can you do? Is it? One row this side, Devata. Other side is Asuras. Both side now. By the way, I am to say, see, Bhagwan's avatars are many, huh? But all avatars are not made for us to do puja and all that. Don't do puja, Mohini avatar. <laughs> Ra, Sri Ram Avatar, Sri Krishna Avatar, huh? Anyway, now come back to this. I am telling very briefly only, huh? And how? Oh yeah. So Bhagwan first started giving Amrita to Devtas. and now when they looking at asura smiling hamara number bhi aayega aayega so amruta was given to devata smile was given to (laughs) 
That's why in the first shlok I said, Amruto Madhura Shanto Deva Sarva Gunalaya Varado Yascha Bhaktanam Tam Vande Shri Harim Sada Anyway, what happened even though devutas, for the time being, they got Amrutam, but they could not sustain it. The same thing happened with the Asuras. So what happened? Labdhvapi, Amrutam, Devaha, Safalana, Prayodhya, they, they really, if you really see that, the if, whole story, if you read, what they wanted to become mighty and permanent and all that, but that did not happen. Short-lived only. Tasmad ayam na mukhyarthaha pratibhati vicharataha. Therefore, when you think about this, then we come to know this kind of amrutam, a kind of drink, uh, cannot be the primary and chief mukhya meaning of the word amrutam. It cannot be some kind of drink, you know. Drink here, coke and thumbs up and all, I don't know what all that. Huh? Because it is not a one kind of drinks only. Of the problem, you know. Now, this is not the Mukhyarthaha. No, see, in the Isha, Isha Vasu Prishad, so it was not said about drink. Huh. In the Pauranic story, a kind of drink, you know, PM. But when it was said, the combination of Vidya Karma. The main meaning was there are karma and vidya me upasanas. That's what they were pointed out in Isha Vastu Upanishad. So when it was said in Isha Vastu Upanishad, avidya amrutyum tirtva vidya amruta mashnute, then what was that amrutatva? Huh? Vedokta karmana vapi. Tasya vidya samuchayat amaratvam cha yat proktam tan nityam itishrutihi. And even in the Upanishad, when the combination of karma and upasana they are pointed out, and the upasana phalam is immortality which is said. But Vedokta Karmana Vapi, by Vedokta Karma Upasana also the Amritatvam that you get, yet Proktam Amaratvam, that also is not Nityam, not eternal. That also Apekshikam only. Somebody may go to the heavens as a result of Karma Upasana. Uh, you may become a celestial being. Uh, as a result of your Punya Karma. But the Shruti only, which talks about that, the Shruti only says, that is not a permanent thing. Bhagavad Gita also says, and the Kshine Punya Marthya Lokam Vishanti. So Marthya Lokam only, Ved Amaratvam. So when the Punyas are exhausted, Again, the jivas here come back to this world of mortals only. So temporary uh, relief is there. As Kathopanishad says, uh, in the Swarga Loka, Amaratvam, Amrutatvam, Swarga Loke, Swarga Loke, Na Bhayam Kinchanasti, Na Tatratvam, Na Jaraya Pibheti, Ubhe Tirtva Asanaya Pipase, Shokati go modate swargaloke. So in the swargaloka, the fear of old age and death is not there. 
whatever time period you live there young only so body level aging and death is not there ubhe tva asanaya pipase hunger and thirst that is prana level hunger and thirst problem is not there already paid for so plenty of food is there drink there everything is there and the shoka moha which comes to us grief and delusion and fear because of old age and death or because of hunger and thirst that is not there that is mental level ubhet itva asanaya pipate shoka diga that shoka which is gone not a permanent one but the shoka the grief or sorrow or fear which is there in this world all are afraid of this aging process or not old age and death yes hunger and thirst yes and because of that what a shoka moha arises so in the swarga loka this is not there because of your punya karma you are gone there so as long as you are there enjoy it's a great vacation and then vacate <laughs> that place just come down so vedokta karmana chapi तस्य विद्या समुच्चयात् अमरत्वं च यत् प्रोक्तं तन्न नित्यम् इति श्रुति तो इट इज नॉट ए ड्रिंक इट इज नॉट इवन गोइंग टू गोइंग टू हेवन एंड ऑल दैट दैट इज ऑल्सो नॉट अमृता सो देन व्हाट इज अमृतम neti neti this is not that is not then what is that that we'll see in the afternoon what is real amrutatvam that we'll see in the second session okay okay no why should i tell now so what inspired that enquiry various statements which are there on what all this story says so you have to know what is true that we'll see hmm, in the afternoon but now let us chant seeing the name of bhagwan hmm? let us see hmm. जय सिया राम जय जय सिया राम जय सिया राम जय जय सिया राम बोलो राम 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 सीता राम बोलो राम राम बोलो राम 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 सीता राम बोलो राम 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 सीता राम जय सिया राम जय जय सिया Jay
हनुमान की उमापति महादेव की बोलो भाई सब संतन की जय सदगुरुनाथ महाराज की जय ओम पूर्णमदा पूर्णमिद पूर्णा पूर्ण उदच्यते पूर्णस्य पूर्णमादाय पूर्णमेवशिष्य ओ शाति 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 हरि श्रीगुरुभ्यो नम हरि ओम